Hello friends, I am Sanjay Gupta. In this video, I am going to demonstrate you how we can move rectangle. So two header files, Conio and Graphics.h have been included. Inside main function, GD, GM variables are declared. Clear device, sorry, CLSCR is used. Then int graph function is used, which is receiving three arguments, GD, GM and a path, which is indicating graphics library. Then set color function is used, which is for foreground color. Set background color uh, is for background color. Then uh, for loop is used, which is starting from one and it is uh, repeating till hundred. It is incremented by five. Inside for loop delay function is used so that uh, uh, we can make uh, some uh, distance between printing of two rectangles. Then clear device erases a particular rectangle so that new rectangle can be printed. So a rectangle function is used to print a rectangle. It has four arguments. First is for left, second for top coordinate, then right coordinate and then bottom coordinate. So you can see I have incremented values of top and bottom coordinate. So this uh, uh, when, when I will be executing this code, so a rectangle will be shifting from top to bottom. So now I am executing this code. You can see the output uh, rectangle is shifting from top to bottom. So if I want to move it for longer time, so I have to uh, increase number of rotation. So I have changed value of 100 by 300. Now I am executing this code. So you can see the output rectangle is uh, shifting or moving more number of times. So right now it is shifting from top to bottom. If you want to shift it from left to right, so you have to change in left and right coordinates. So right now top and bottom coordinates are fixed and left and right coordinates are incremented. So now I am going to again execute this code. So you can see the output uh, this time rectangle is shifting from left to right. So friends. With the help of this example, you can uh, do this uh, action on your laptop. You can move any kind of rectangle from left to right, from top to bottom or in any direction. So uh, implement this code in your laptop and use this concept uh, while making any kind of project with the help of graphics in C. Thank you for watching this video.